Welcome back to Drop Dead the Cabin Tips and Tricks 2. So there are a few extra tips I've found which are just as important as the ones from the first video, so here they are. So through round 1 and 2, it's important to get as many points as possible to open up more doors faster, to get the fuel cells as quickly as possible. The way to get more points is by making as many headshots as possible, as for each headshot you get 2 cash points instead of 1. In the first two rounds, you should be able to get mostly all headshots as the zombies come at a much lower rate. These extra points should enable you to get a minimum of one of the fuel cells required, plus a few ammo or health chests if you wish to open them. So tip number two. At first you may not notice that there is a specific way to pick up the fuel cell. So when the zombies knock it off the generator, you will need to quickly get there, pick it up and place it back on the generator. Make sure to stand at the bottom of the fuel cell to pick it up. I tried many times to pick it up from a different angle and it wouldn't work and ultimately I would get attacked and lose health. This may be something the developers may change in time but I kind of like that you can't pick it up from any angle it just adds another awkward element to adjust to it's kind of nice. So for tip number three within the first two rounds you're likely to fill your ammo pouch from boxes lying around the cabin. As you kill zombies and use up bullets try to pick up the ammo the zombies drop instead of using ammo found on the sides or in crates. At the end of each round, the ammo dropped by zombies disappears, whereas the ammo found around the map or in crates does not despawn. At some point, you're likely to have an ammo shortage. This method should help you get around this. It would be great to complete this game in co-op mode, but the game isn't currently matching me up in co-op. So if you'd like to also complete the game in co-op, leave me a message below and we can give it a go trying to get to extraction. It would also be great to hit at least 10 likes and 10 subscribers on this video. If you found this video helpful and interesting, please like and subscribe. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video.